Welcome to Shekhar Maths. Today we are going to observe 10th class mathematics SSC public model paper 1 based on the chapters 1, 2, 3 100 marks for the academic year 2021-22. Now let us see the syllabus. First chapter is real numbers. Second chapter sets. And third chapter is polynomials. On these chapters only model paper 1 is prepared. Now, model paper 1 for SSE Public Examinations 2022, Mathematics for Class 10, Maximum Marks is 100 and Time Allotted is 3 hours 15 minutes. Now, Instructions. 15 minutes, first 15 minutes is allotted for reading the question paper. Number 2, question paper consists of 4 sections and 33 questions. Now let us take section 1. Note, answer all the questions. Each question carries 1 mark. There are 12 questions. So 12 into 1 mark is 12 marks. Now let us take first question. Which is correct? P. Product of two irrational numbers is always a rational number. Let us take for example root 2 irrational into root 3 irrational their product to root 6 also irrational but given in the statement rational so first statement p is false second 2 is rational root 3 is irrational their product to 2 into root 3 is again an irrational so the statement q is true so correct is only q statement so the correct choice is 2 now number 2 if a is subset of b then we can say that A is a small set and B is a big set. But uh, union of two sets always becomes a big set. So that is equal to B. Now third, if P of X is equal to X square plus 5X plus 4, then P of 1 put to 1 in place of X. Then P of 1 is 1 square plus 5 into 1 plus 4. 1 square is 1, 5 into 1 is 5 plus 4 which is total is 10 so the answer is 10 write the decimal form of the rational number 7 by 2 square into 5 that is 7 by 4 into 5 because 2 square is equal to 4 which is equal to 7 by 20 because 4 into 5 is 20 now 20 can be written as 2 into 10 now 7 by 2 is 3.5 by 10 which is equal to 0. 3, 5 is the answer. Now, fifth bit. If A is equal to 1, 2, 3 and phi is a empty set, find A intersection phi. Intersection of any two sets gives always a small set and we know that empty set or null set is the smallest of all. So, the answer is phi or empty set. Number six. Find the number of zeros in the below graph of polynomial. Observe that the polynomial is intersecting the x axis at three different places given by the three circles. So, number of zeros is 3. Now, number 7. Log 16 base 2 minus log 4 base 2 can be written as log 16 by 4 base 2 because log x minus log y is equal to log x by y. So, the answer is log 16 by 4 base 2. 8. If A is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, B is equal to 2, 3, 4, then find A intersection B. Intersection of any two sets is nothing but the common elements, that is 2, 3, 4, so which is also in the set B, so the answer is B. The zero of the polynomial 7x minus 5 is 7 by 5. Let us see. 7x minus 5 is equal to 0, then 7x is equal to 5. Then x is equal to 5 by 7, which is wrong in the given statement. So the statement is false. Now, 10th question Determine the value of a log 8 by 27 base 2 by 3. 8 by 27 can be written as 2 by 3 whole cube. So, which can be written as 3 into log 2 by 3 base 2 by 3, which is equal to 3 into 1. So, answer is 3. Now 11, if n of a in and b is equal to n of a plus n of b, then which type of sets are a and b? Observe that there are no common points between a and b. So, these sets are called disjoint sets. 
Now number 12. Match the following. Type of polynomial degree. Cubic polynomial has degree 3. Quadratic polynomial has degree 2. And linear polynomial has degree 1. And constant polynomial has degree 0. So the correct choice is C. Now let us take section 2. Note. Answer all the questions. Each question carries 2 marks. There are 8 questions. So 8 into 2 marks is 16 marks. Now let us take 13th question. If x is equal to log 3 base 2 and y is equal to log 5 base 2 then express log 15 base 2 in terms of x and y. It is the question from the chapter 1. 14th, draw the Venn diagrams for the following 1, 2, 3, 4. It is the question from the second chapter sets. 15. If p of x is equal to 5 into x power 7 minus 6 into x power 5 minus 3x plus 8, then find coefficient of x power 5 and degree of p of x. It is the question from the third chapter polynomials. Now 16. Check whether 6 power n end with the digit 0 for any natural number n. It is a question from the chapter 1. That is real numbers. 17. Find all the subsets for the set A is equal to PQ. It is a question from the second chapter sets. 18th. Check whether minus 3 and 3 are zeros of the polynomial x square minus 9. It is a question from the third chapter polynomials. 19. Check whether the given prime or composite. It is a question from the first chapter real numbers. Now 20. Write the set builder form for the set A is equal to minus 2, minus 1, 0, 1, 2. It is a question from the second chapter sets. Now let us take section 3. Answer all the questions. Each question carries 4 marks. There are 8 questions. So 8 into 4 is 32 marks. Now let us take first question. That is 21st. Show that every positive odd integer is in the form of 4q plus 1 or 4q plus 3 where q is any integer. It is a question from the first chapter real numbers. 22nd. If x square plus y square is equal to 25xy, then prove that 2 into log of x plus y is equal to 3 log 3 plus log x plus log y. It is a question. 23. Find zeros of the polynomials x square minus 3 and check relationship between the zeros and the coefficients of the polynomial. It is the question from the third chapter polynomials. Now 24th question. Write 2 log 3 plus 3 log 5 minus 5 log 2 as a single logarithms. 25th question. Write a quadratic polynomial with zeros minus 2 and 1 by 3. It is a question from the third chapter, polynomials. Now, 26th question. Write the following sets in a roster form. A, B, C, D sets are given. It is a question from the second chapter, sets. 27. If log of x plus y by 3 is equal to half into log x plus log y, then find x by y plus y by x. It is a question from the first chapter, real numbers. 28. Find the quadratic polynomial where the sum and the product of whose zeros are minus 3 and 2. It is a question from the third chapter, polynomials. Now let us take section 4. Note. Answer all the questions. Each question carries 8 marks. There are 5 questions. So, 5 into 8 marks is 40 marks. Now 29th question, show that the cube of any positive integer is in the form of 9m or 9m plus 1 or 9m plus 8. It is a question from the first chapter real numbers. Now 30, show that root 2 plus root 3 is an irrational number. It is a question from the first chapter real numbers. Now let us take 31. If a is equal to x such that x is a natural number, b is equal to x such that x is even natural number, c is equal to x such that x is an odd natural number, d is equal to x such that x is a prime number, then find that number 1 a minus b, b intersection c, a union b and b minus d. This is a question from the second chapter, 
Now 32. Draw the graph x square minus x minus 12 and find its zeros. 33. Draw the graph x square minus 6x plus 9 and find its zeros. So these questions are from the third chapter polynomials. It is prepared by Shaker Maths. So prepare this type of problems and get good marks. Best of luck for revision test 1. Thanks for watching video. Don't forget to subscribe. Say karma.